Hello guys, today we're gonna do a setup tour. Holy shit, I look like ass in front of camera. So here's here's the entire room. And this is actually my dad's office. It's not mine. It's not my room. My room's on the other side of this wall. And uh yeah, this is not my PC as well as my dad's PC. Um, the only reason I play here is because, um, you know, his setup is actually quite decent and it runs all the games pretty well. I averaged like, what, 400, 300, 300 or 400 FPS in Battlefield 4 back then, so that's why I was playing here a lot during 2022. Uh, 2021, before that, I was playing on the other side, but the one thing, the one annoying thing is that uh, the monitor refresh rate itself, so... Let's start with the PC first. Uh, nothing special. Ryzen seven. You know, you got your sixteen gigs of RAM. Uh, GTX sixteen fifty Ti. That's a GPU, I believe. And the fuck do I use this shit? Yeah, I don't think you can see shit, but the SD, SSD, and stuff. And yeah, let's move on to the mouse. This is a G304. My dad bought this like for 200 bucks right now, it's quite cheap. It's like 100 something. And yeah, it's kind of like the G102, but it's a, obviously a wireless version. And it's slightly heavier, I believe. Maybe like 10 grams heavier. Oh, whatever. I'm no mouse enthusiast anyway. I just use any mouse you gave me. And moving on, you have the mouse pad. It's a QCK large, I believe. It's about four. That's not four. I don't know how long, how big is this, but I think it's the large one. Yeah, this is. I think my ba my dad bought this for me as well. It's like two hundred something, or hundred something. I'm not so sure. And there's the internet, uh, router, modem, whatever you called. Uh, I think it's seven hundred meg, or five hundred something. So yeah, the download speed is actually goated. Like, you can install Battlefield 5 in like less than 20 minutes with this thing. So, sometimes it's good, sometimes it's bad. Depends on the time as well. Like at night, it's very, like it's awful. I'm having like packet losses whenever I connect servers to uh, Japan and stuff. But, if you're talking about like, you know, closer regions and stuff like Singapore, I have no issues with that. Like, my heat rack is actually quite crisp in Singapore servers in Battlefield 5 applies to other games as well and here we have a Fantac K512 I believe this is a one-handed keyboard for those of you who don't know and I think it has like a couple of modes on it you have like lighting, like red, blue, green, purple, fucking there's cyan, there's yellow, there's like white, there's like any color you could possibly imagine it has like different modes I think like you can adjust the speed lighting it doesn't have much actually but it's only like 100 something actually less than 100 bucks I think I bought this like in 2020 and if you're wondering what's this this is actually a sticker that my school gave me they actually gave me they gave us like a lunchbox during the quarantine like when COVID was actually a thing uh, they gave us like free lunch boxes and they gave this sticker for the lunch box so yeah that's my name in Chinese, this is my school number, this is my class, GTA 1, which basically basically means that this is the first class by the way. Out of 14 classes, I'm in the top class. Imagine being addicted to video games and still being in the top class, bro. I cannot. Anyway, um, there's a Razer sticker from my uh, Sinosa keyboard. This is on my PC. Um, Here's this office keyboard that my dad uses it for uh, graphic design and stuff, for work related stuff basically. And the thing is, this thing actually performs well, performs better compared to this. This is actually quite garbage, it's actually getting garbage day by day I swear to god. Like, every time I log in and I play Battlefield 5, I keep spamming the C button, it doesn't work somehow. But it actually works on this keyboard, like this keyboard is way more responsive compared to this crap. I don't know why. Uh, I believe this model is actually quite old. is way more older compared to this. I, I, I bought this in 2020. My dad bought this in like 2019 or 2018, I believe. I was about 12 at that time. 
And moving on, we have the Xbox wireless controller. The Bluetooth thingy does not work anymore for some reason, so I had to use a Type-C cable. Yeah, and here are my speakers. I actually don't play with, a, with earphones or headsets. I used to, but uh, my cat bit the the wires on the earphones, so I ended up playing with speakers and my dad was saying, was saying shit like how whenever he calls me, like inside the house or outside, like I couldn't hear him, so he started blaming me because I was wearing too much earphones and stuff. Even though I rarely wear them, I rarely wore them. Even if I did, I just lowered my volume is super low. Like I was listening to music most of the time. I could give, I could give less a fuck about the audio in game anyway. And then uh, yeah, I think one of them is actually quite. It's actually broken. Like it's not working. So the audio is kind of like half sided, one sided. And here we have the monitor. Hang okay, on, let me turn this on. And what the fuck? Okay. Yeah, the monitor. Nothing special. It's nothing special, honestly. It's a 1440p uh, Dell office desktop. This thing is actually 9 years old, if I'm not mistaken. My mom bought this for my dad on his uh, 41st birthday, if I'm not mistaken. And uh, yeah, obviously the refresh rates. Hang on. So yeah, this is what I play on. Honestly, the mouse movement is so laggy. It's actually delayed. It's way worse than 2042 mouse input delay if you're playing on an actual setup. Like this thing, if you compare this refresh rate compared to my other monitor, which is also the Dell, but it's a 70 hertz, 75 hertz version, like that thing is way better, I'm telling you. I swear to God, the difference is like night and day, even though it's like, what, 15 hertz apart. So yeah, anyway, uh, what am I missing? Oh yeah, here's the webcam. This thing actually works quite decent actually. Yeah, that's a nice webcam. It works as a mic as well. And here's a printer. Here's my water bottle. Uh, yeah, I think that's it. This is basically my setup. I think the only thing that I need improvements on. Uh, I need. I obviously need to change this monitor. And for the mouse pad. Bro, it's actually quite awful. Just look at these scratches, bro. These are cat scratches. It used to be so clean. But ever since I changed from playing in my room to playing, coming in my dad's office to play video games, like, oh my god, look at these cat scratches. That's fucking fur. And so, yeah, there's no surprise that my mouse feels even more shittier. Like, this and this combination of... This combination... Both of the combinations are... Both 60 hertz and this crappy ass mouse pad is ruined, bro. Like it's like icing on the cake uh, when it comes to turbo tracking. But whatever, bro. Whatever works, bro. Better than having nothing. Anyway, so yeah. Uh, thanks for watching and see you guys in the next one. Peace.